Hello, any anybody in, in on, on, online, um, especially Nigerian young opera singers, Nigerian young classical musicians. I just want to chip in some encouraging words to you guys. Um, I know this I've I've not been I've not been doing this video live video for a while, but I I want to from time to time to chip in some. Um, words to Nigerians classical musicians upcoming Nigerian classical musicians uh, we have a lot to offer to the world and um, I, I I believe that we can we can do that we can do what um, our colleagues are, are doing abroad especially in Europe I'm seeing a few friends online I'm seeing Matthew Morgan hello Matthew <clears throat> Joseph Pauling and uh, I greet you all. Um, so I, I want to say first, first of all, you need to be sure of what you want to do. You need to ask yourself, um, is this really the genre in which I want to move into? Then thank you, Omotolani. Um, what is the next step for you to do? What are you supposed to move into? find a way to get some music education first of all find a way around to get yourself a good voice teacher if you can't find anyone in nigeria try as much as you can to get some level of um, um vocal coaches level um, level of um, some coaching get your theory and find a way to study abroad if you get yourself a scholarship, that is a great thing. There are a lot of people out there. Hey, I'm seeing, I'm seeing um, Agatha. So try as much as you can to get admission. Work hard, get admission out there. There are many schools out there who gives international scholarships. If you really, 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 really want to be something, it, the, the little information, the little education you get here is not really going to take you very, very far. It can take you to somewhere, but it's not really going to get it that far. But you really need to move out of your comfort zone. A lot are happening in Lagos. Uh, we are doing a lot to educate, um, especially Muson is doing a lot, so much to educate um, a lot of um, um, classical musicians, be it instrumentalists or be it um, singers. I'm doing my own little way because after studying abroad, I have to come back to see what I can to impact the students, um, the classical musicians here. So please, please do not let anybody, do not let anybody tell you you cannot do this. If you have sought your heart out and you know that you can move on, you know that this is what you want to do, not because somebody else is doing it, but because this is what gives you pleasure. Pursue it to the highest international level as much as you can. What we majorly most times set our minds into doing is what we get. What you put your mind into is what you get. Believe in what you have. Believe in the talents that you got. And I see you moving on and moving on and doing so many things. There are a lot of things I do in my in this um, career, which sometimes I don't really know how I get myself doing them. But when I realize that I have a talent, when I know that I have this talent that is pushing me, that's giving me this great passion into what I'm doing, then I realize that this is not just physical. Talent is spiritual. And you have to try as much as you can to move into this spiritual realm. How do you do this? You have yourself 
from time to time something keeps pushing you in a gentle way in your mind do this for your talent do this for your talent i think you have to listen to that listen to that all the time and move on with it but the aim of this video is to encourage young opera singers to push you to where i think you can get yourself to it is not just being in one place you have all it takes you have all it, it takes to be like any other international singer you have all it takes to really move on and go beyond where you are you have all it takes you have all it takes it's every you have a lot once you have the talent and you have the willpower to move on then carry on carry on and you will get to where you're heading to you get to the to the destiny in which you are you, you are on but remember one thing that we all have a different calling remember at the same time that we that we have a role to play on this earth and no one's role is the same when you come you play your path on the earth and you die and you go so you have to play it very well this is the calling we have one of the essence of living it's it's just to do what we came to do on earth and we go back to where we came from so try as much as you can to work hard all the time thank you and god bless you all so i'm going to take off now i'm going to thank all the people who are saying hello to me i mr <clears throat> pauline hang i greet you Matthew, hey Anieto, CJ Man, Omo, Omo Tala, Elizabeth Olufa, <clears throat> M Square Mary Martha, thank you, Ibe Agatha, thank you, Enobong Idem, thanks. So Diary, so Diary, thank you so much for this. Ah, Padre, Dozier, Ifanye, thank you. Mary Ayurime Bili, Honorable Loba Olumayoa Olufisayo Omo, thank you all. Ifani, Solomon Mo, Daniel, hey Daniel, Daniel, you're here. I see you. My uncle, that is AGK, me. I greet you. Hi, Mr. Tony, thank you so much for waving. Ano Roche de Ma, thank you. Thank you. You are also a good man. Thank you, Mr. Anthony. So, Diary, thanks so, for this. Angoli, well done. James Olawale Kazim. Benefa. Maria Okorafo, thank you. Chukuda Korando. James Gohi, thanks a lot. Oh, you know my student. It's been a long time. Where did you run to? Joshua. Oluwada Milare Abioye. How are you? Thank you. I hail you all. So I'm going to move on now. <laughs> Joshua, I've said it. <laughs> he said, what about you? You were the last person that came online, so I just saw you now. <laughs> Troublemaker like you, Joshua. <laughs> okay. So... Um, I've given the message I want to give, so I have to move on now. I need to move to where I'm going to now. So, see you guys. From time to time, I'm going to be dropping some encouraging messages and um, messages that can inspire whoever. I don't know. We, we do things little by little that we don't know, but we inspire people. So. A lot of few things I do, a lot of people come to me, they say, you have inspired me, inspired me. I've come to realize that even when you do things unknowingly, you inspire, inspire a lot of people. So that's, very, that's why we need to be good all the time and be nice to people. We need. You don't know if that's the only time you're going to cross, cross paths with that person. And that was destined for you to do something good for the person in life. You have to. See you guys. Bless you. Bless you all. Thank you.